Hello dear students, how are you doing? So students, in the previous video, I defined, I explained consumer good, capital good and producer good. In this video, we will deep dive in the concept of consumer good, capital good and producer good. Because this is the topic of critical significance. The topic of consumer good and capital good is of critical significance. Now here question arises that what is the significance of consumer good and capital good? Why we are doing study about consumer good and capital good? The first significance of reading about consumer good and capital good is that the topic is very helpful while calculating GDP. The expenditure on both the goods will be included while calculating the GDP. So this is the first significance of consumer good and capital good. Now we come to the second one. In the previous video, I have told you students that we all are consumer in this world. We consume durables, semi-durables, non-durables and services. Every time we are busy in consumption, consumption and consumption. From birth till death, we do consumption. Even while sleeping, we do consumption of most luxurious thing like AC, bed, cooler, etc. See, even right now you are consuming the battery of your cell phone and you are consuming the services produced by me. So consumer goods are of critical significance. Consumer goods increases our quality of life directly. That's why we all consume consumer goods. And capital good and producer good increases our quality of life indirectly because producers with the help of capital good and producer good produces consumer goods. So both the goods increases our quality of life indirectly. Both the goods increases production capacity in the economy which is helpful for the growth and development of an economy. So I explain the significance of consumer good and capital good. The first is it is very helpful in calculating the GDP and the second is both the goods both the goods increases the quality of life directly and indirectly and capital good and producer good increases growth and development of an economy so students now question arises that who consumes consumer goods and who consumes producer good and capital good the answer is consumer the answer is consumer purchases consumer good and and we all are consumer. Consumer purchases consumer goods and we all are consumer. And some of us are producer also. So here we derive the line that all the producers are consumer too. All producer are consumer but all consumers are not producer. And producer purchases capital good and producer good for the production so these two person are final users so these two person are final users you can say the end user before starting the new concept i am repeating the previous concept consumer goods includes durable semi durable non durables and services capital good includes fixed assets only Producer good includes fixed asset as well as raw material. Dear students, in the previous video, I told you that Caesar purchased by tailor is not a capital good because this is not of very high value. Then Caesar will be included in producer good because producer good includes also small tools and implements which are used in the production of other goods like screwdriver like screwdriver hammer like scissors so producer good includes fixed asset raw material small tools and implements like screwdriver hammer scissor Dear students, we cannot classify that certain goods are consumer goods, certain goods are producer goods and certain goods are capital goods. The same good may be capital good, consumer good and producer good. It depends on end user that certain good is a capital good, consumer good or producer good. And there are two end users, consumer and producer. There are two end users, consumer and producer. Consumer purchase consumer goods and producer purchase 
capital good and producer goods so students here are some examples that whether a good is consumer good capital good or producer good the first example is car car is whether a consumer good capital good or producer good it depend on end user it depend on end user if a car is purchased by consumer then it is consumer good and if a car is purchased by business unit it is capital good it is is fixed asset like if a car is purchased by taxi driver if a car is purchased by tourism company then it is capital good and all the capital good are producer good too then car is also a producer good too now come to the example of bike bike whether bike is a consumer good capital good or producer good it depend on end user if bike is purchased by consumer then it is consumer good and if bike is purchased by producer for further production like tourism company purchases bike then it is capital good and it is a producer good too because producer good includes fixed asset also now come to the example of cycle if cycle is purchased by consumer then it is consumer good and if it is purchased by circus it it will be deemed as capital good so it depend on end use whether a good is capital good consumer good or producer good the end user are consumers and producers comb and scissors if it is purchased by consumer then it is consumer good and if it is purchased by barber shop then it will not be deemed as capital good it will be deemed as producer good this will come into this head small tools and implements bed and sofa set whether bed or sofa suit set consumer good capital good or producer good bed and sofa set depend on end user whether it is a consumer good capital good or producer good if bed and sofa set are purchased by consumer then it is consumer good and if bed and sofa set are purchased by hotel and restaurant then it is capital good and it is producer good too last example vegetables if vegetables are purchased by consumer then it is consumer good and if vegetable are purchased by business unit like restaurant then vegetable will be deemed as producer good this will be included in raw material so dear students we derive the concept that same good may be capital good consumer good and producer good it depend on end user whether a good is capital good consumer good and producer good and the end user are consumers and producers mm -hmm.